it is the traveling Viking coming to you from Ankara in Turkey. I've just arrived the other day, the other week in Turkey, but the other day here in Ankara and I'm already loving it. You can hear the mosques in the background, which goes about once, about like four, five, six times every single day, every few hours. One of the mosques are singing like this in the background. As I say, we're in Ankara. From here, we're going to start in the Turkish capital. We're going to explore the whole country of Turkey. Tomorrow, in fact, I'm hopping on a train all the way to the east to the Turkish Kurdistan, a town called Tatwan, next to Turkey's biggest lake in the Turkish Kurdistan area. Before a 27 hour train journey, which awaits me tomorrow, I think we should go and explore Ankara today. We're going to go see if we can find a little market and yeah buy up on some some snacks that we will most definitely need for this train ride tomorrow uh, tomorrow afternoon video. hello how are you <laughs> video yeah. for youtube Osman hello salam <laughs> you want to say something <laughs> exactly how are you? Where is it? Dinamarca. America. Dinamarca. Dinamarca. That's it. Do you work here? You work here? Job? Here? Okay. Do you have um, tea? Turkish tea? <laughs> We're traveling here in Turkey. What do you here in Turkey, most people don't, huh? Yeah, tea? Tea? Yeah. Turkey? Turkey tea? <laughs> see ya! I don't think he understands me. So yeah, as you can see, this is gonna be a challenge. I've already, when I bought my tickets on the train, I was talking to the lady behind the till with Google Translate. So thank God for Google Translate. But, I was asking him for Turkish tea, as you can hear. My voice, I'm a bit rusty. I've been down with a cold over the last few days. But I think the only time I ever drink tea is when I feel a little bit ill. And as you can see here, all the men are sitting getting a Turkish tea. So I think we should sit down and try chai, one. Chai. Hello. Hello, Turkish tea? Tea. How much? Uh, How much one tea? Tea. One tea. I can have one tea? Chai. How Chai. much? Uh, one of this. Turkey tea. 7 TL. 7 lira. Turkey biliyor musun sen? 10? 7. Okay. One please. Evet. So we're going to get one of these teas that we see here on the on the commercial. This is what all the guys here that you can see around here are sitting drinking Turkish tea. And as I said, I've been down with the cold over the last few days. So I think the best way to start our exploration of Turkey, of Ankara, is to try the traditional tea that all Turkish people drink literally all the day. I don't think they really drink water here, they just drink tea, tea, tea. Here we go. Chai. Okay. Chai. Yeah, chai and the cigar. Cigar. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So all the, all the Turkish guys smoke here as well. I don't think that's the best for my throat right now. But we'll just have the tea. Let's try. <sighs> My throat. <coughs> bad, bad throat. Uh, no cigarita. <laughs> Thank you very much, though. Thank you very much. It tastes like a normal black tea, like an English breakfast type tea, uh, Earl Grey, that type of tea. As I said, I'm not really a big tea drinker, but when you have a sore throat like I do right now, <sighs> this kind of thing goes right in, serves me really well. Let's finish up our tea and then we'll see. Hello. <laughs> and then we'll keep exploring more of the Ankara, old center, old city. I've been staying, I'm staying here just around the corner in a hotel and I see up here around the other corner around over here there is a market going on up there cheers skol
in Turkish tea from Ankara. So we're getting another tea, this time with lime in it, I think. Let's go and see what he's making up here. Check out the carpets as well. The beautiful Turkish carpets. Uh, here. Okay, thank you. Do you have lime? Limon? No, no, limon. Limon. This one? Okay. Different tea. A different one. Okay, and this is where you make the tea. Chai, coffee. Chai, Nescafe, coffee. Kushburnu, Ororit, Nescafe, Chiwi. All many tea, many tea. Many, many Danish. Very many tea. Very little, 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 found the middle. Very small cup. Nobody brings big cup. And here, what is this? Özel. Özel. Tabi. Something you mold. Yeah. Beautiful machine. Old machine. Very. Kazan. Kazan. Chai Kazan. Kazan. Sijak su. Kazan in Russia? Kazan, Russia? Yo, Turkish. Okay. Meşale. Meşale. Okay. <laughs> What's your name? Uh, Mehmet Ali. Mehmet. Okay. You're Sebastian. 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 Nice, nice to meet you. you. <laughs> I drink the tea. Those machines as well, we see literally everywhere. All sorts of restaurants have this. And yeah, seven, seven Turkish lira is literally cents on the dollar. I don't know, might be maybe 10 cents uh, in dollar terms. Let's try this lime tea, lime tea thing here. It's green, it looks very different. Oh yeah, that's exactly what I need. I think it has some mints in there as well. Oh yeah, I feel that. Ah, yeah, that's much better than the other one. But yeah, as you can see, this is the tradition. All the Turkish guys, especially the old men, come here to drink tea each afternoon. I guess they finish work. Beautiful. There you go. That's good. Tip for you. Tip me. Oh, for you. That's for you. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. As you can see, people are very nice here. They don't speak much Turkish at all. Or Turkish they do. English. They don't speak much English whatsoever. Hello, how are you? Good, good, you? <laughs> they don't speak much English. So we gotta try just kind of making it with sign language and saying <coughs> throat bad. And he was like, oh, I get it. Drink this tea, try this one. All right, we'll head up here. We've got one of the main streets. Hello, Hello. <laughs> how are Where you? Are you from? Denmark. I'm from Turkey. You're from Turkey? Ankara? Yes. Or from somewhere else? Los, Los Haymanas. Haymanas. What's that? YouTube. YouTube? Yes. yes. <laughs> Repeat after me. Huh? Repeat after yes. me. Yes. Yeah, yeah. En büyük Ankara YouTube. En büyük Ankara YouTube. I know. What does that mean? Thank what you. does it mean? Something with Ankara. Don't speak in English. Don't speak in English. You speak a little Aynen. English. <laughs> give me, give me. Yeah, okay. How I say in Turkish? Thank you. But thank you. In Turkish? Teşekkür ederim. What? Teşekkür ederim. Teşekkür ederim. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> All right. Have a good day. Have a good day. <laughs> I nailed it. My thank you there. I've already forgotten what, what it was. Timmiş Ankara'da. Something like that. All right. Let's go over here. But we have a statue looming large over here on this square. A statue of the founding father of Turkey. So up here on the horse sits Turkish fa Turkey's founding father, Mustafa Ataturk. Mustafa Ataturk founded the country and was the father, was the, yeah, basically the father of Turkey, was the first president in the country from 1923 
till he died basically he was the president here in Ankara was where he signed the declaration of independence for the for the new country the Republic of Turkey after the Ottoman Empire fell apart check out the statue here I'm noticing a lot of uh, flags with his face on it so he's obviously a very very popular figure still the country was founded by him and is still celebrating him to this day today so now that we've paid our respects to Mr. Atatürk we're ready to go and explore this beautiful country that he ensured would still exist after the first world war after the fall of the Ottoman Empire let's go and explore Turkey this is gonna be fun I'm really really looking forward to to getting <coughs> to getting out and exploring Turkey as you can hear my throat is still a bit bad I excuse for the coughs that will come on every now and then but I'm soldiering through let's go check out all the herbs here it's beautiful I wish you could smell. I wish I could bring the smell to you. Garlic cloves here. Gone. Oh my god, it smells good. Look at that. Selling bread. Obviously a famous, famous thing. All the women here are buying bread for their homes. Here we got the Turkish feta cheese. I think they call it feta cheese here. Or maybe it's only the Greeks. If it is... You may very much, hello, <laughs> you may very much excuse me, all Turks that will be watching this. I know the Greeks are trying to steal all your food. But I need someone. We also want to try some kind of street food for sure. But first we're going to get some snacks. Oh yeah, look at this. We're going to have to come back here. Check that out. Some kind of bread sandwich with uh, with meat in it. Here I think we have just what we're looking for. Hello. Hello. Do you have uh, dates? Dates? Check, oh, um, cashew. Cashew. Cashew? Cashew, cheddar. Okay, inside. I'm not sure if he has dates. Cashew. you taste. Taste. Okay, let's taste. That's here. Where are you from? No. Oh, salty. Nice. Um. That's she. Denmark. Denmark. Uh huh. Natural better. Better. Na this one. How much? Um, 500 gram? 500. Half kilo? Half kilo. Welcome, Mrs. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. I'm good. I'm good. You what? say here, uh, salam. You salam. say to say hello in Turkish. You say salam. Alaikum salam. Salam alaikum. Alaikum salam. Salam alaikum. Alaikum salam. Okay. Welcome. You are so, Denmark. Denmark, yes. French. No, Do Denmark. You speak? French? French, no. no. English and Spanish. Spanish. ¿Cómo estás? Muy bien. Muy bien. ¿Hablas español? ¿Qué haces en Turquía? Uh, viajando. ¿Qué viajando por Turquía. Uh, what is this? No Dates. Sé, no sé mucho uh, español. Ah. Lo sé. ¿Cómo sabes un poco? Lo sé French. 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 Francés. Uh, English un poco. Uh -huh. Turkish. Turkish. <laughs> okay. Okay. Me, English and Spanish. And nice. Danish, of course. But. Nice. You are Denmark? Mm hmm. Denmark. What, what are you doing? Traveling. Traveling? Making videos. When, when you come to Turkey? Um, one week ago. I when? start Istanbul, Ankara. Ankara. Tomorrow After? I go Tatvan. Tatvan. Uh huh. Adam Tatvan, I give you a share in Taiwan, but Tatvan. 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 <laughs> Kurdistan. No Kurdistan. As no Kurdistan. <laughs> you don't like Kurdistan. Pitis. Original. Very good. B what? Pitis. Pitis. Yes. What is Pitis? City. City. 
Ah, the city. city. That one, good city. Beautiful, no? Beautiful. With the lake. That one, not city. Mm -hmm. Witness city, that one, uh, uh, village. Little. Yes. Town, village. Yes, yes. yes. Small town. This, this what do I do with this one? The pig. Can, ah, uh, well, well, yes, yes. Okay. Okay. I take this. So we'll get some cashew nuts, natural cashew nuts. The other ones were fried with salt and that. That's nice, but only for a little bit. Let's see if I understood him right. One fifth. Like this? Yes. Yes. Okay. And they sell tea and things like that here as well. All sorts of stuff. Oh, thank you. Just getting handed stuff left, right, and center here. What's this? Mm. That's nice. This thing, I don't know what it is. But it's really nice. Some kind of sweet thing with coconut on top of it. Mm? So, we've got our first bit of snacks here. Let's see. Here's the guy with the with the straight food. Check it out. Beautiful here. Yeah. All the meats on a roll there. <laughs> Hello. We'll come back to those guys. We'll head inside. There's an indoor part of the market here. Oh, here are dates. The dates that I tried there. The dates that he gave me was a bit hard. That's why I didn't buy it. Also, I think we should try and spread around the the money and, and buy and support as many businesses as we can. Check it out, it's chaotic here. So many people. As you can see, Turkey is it's a mixed country in terms of, of religion. Or like it's not as what I mean is it's not as, as strong um, ruled by religion. There's a separation of religion and government here in Turkey. So that's why you see like the women are not mandated to wear the hijabs and, and this kind of stuff like they are in some of the other Middle Eastern countries. So if you take a look, you see you see women with both the hijab like we have in front of us and we see women just wearing normal clothes like we would in Europe. Hello, Hello. how are you? Oh man, it's busy here. Those guys over here are selling fish. If you see over there. And then we've got fruit and veg on my right side and everybody is screaming like mental. Hello, hello. <laughs> Let's see what he's selling over here. Fish, fish, fish. Fish, fish. Small fish. Sardines. Like... Sardines. Sardines. Okay. Sardines. I see, I see, I see. Very good, very good. Very good, very good. Very good. Very good, very good. So he's selling sardines there. 70 lira for a kilo, I think. It's pretty cheap. Man, it's busy here. Many people. <laughs> oh my god. Check it out here. These guys are selling limes. Mandarina. Mandarina. Where are you from? Denmark. Russia. Huh? Russia. Denmark. 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 Russia. No. Russia. Russia. No Russia. Not Russia. How much for mandarins? How much for 500 gram? 300 gram? This is kilo. Yes, how much kilo? Uh, no, One, just two, like... Uh, two kilo. No kilos, kilos, just a little bit. Like... Uh, 300 gram. Let's try. These mandarins here. Very good. No pits in them, they're small, check it out. Like these little ones here. Let's get over here so I'm not blocking the, the traffic. Hello. Someone called a man. It's only 15 lira for a kilo. Like, again, 27 lira is one dollar. So like, that's half a dollar. Can I have like half kilo? 500 gram? Okay. Half? 
Okay, how much? Uh, not just Mandarin. Tomorrow I go... Ten. Ten lira. Ten. Okay. Ten lira. Yes. Okay, okay. Let's see here. Nissan. Ten. Nissan. Many Nissan. Nissan. Yes. Thank you. Huh? Thank you. Exactly. <laughs> All right, so 10 lira, our next snack. Tomorrow I go train to Tatwan. Yeah. I need snack yeah. for the train. Well, Denmark? Uh, all the world, all the world. No problem, come and get you. <laughs> okay. You, my name is? My name is Sebastian. 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 And you? Sebastian Shamatsky. <laughs> Shamatsky. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's merge our stuff here. Everybody is looking at me here. This is great fun. <laughs> 50, 50, yeah. This is picking my spirits right up. Turkey, Turkey. Turkey, Turkey. Turkey. Hi, Turkey. We've also got palm grenades here. We've got, <coughs> we've got watermelons. We've got all sorts of interesting fruits. We've got grapes here. We've got little chilies. I've had those for my food. They're actually not as spicy as they look. Suddenly we have more space, which is wonderful. Now we can move a little bit better. Look, here's all the chilies. Small chilies, red chilies, beans, green chilies, small chilies here. Hello, hello. <laughs> Ankara. <laughs> Tomatoes. Huh? Video. For YouTube. <laughs> Yes. What do you sell here? E-video. Huh? What about that sell? Video. Ashfa. Uh, YouTube. 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 And? Huh? Sekalanın ne kalanı? Okay. Man, these stickers are saver. You see? This. This is my channel, yes. Okay. 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 Have a good day. Okay, so we are back out of the main section of the market there. I'm thinking now we have nuts, we've got mandarins. Let's see if we can find some dates or maybe this uh, sweet thing that they have here called baklava, which is the famous Turkish pastries, sweet pastries. Let's get this guy mm -hmm. past us here. Check out here as well. Olives, all sorts. Green olives, big, small, black olives, all types of olives here. And sausages as well. There is so much good food here in Turkey. You can Hello. find another food on the left side. This way, left yes. side. Okay, thank you. There's so much great food here in Turkey, huh? That guy spoke some decent English. Hello, it's Logan. How are you? I'm making a video of uh, travel. YouTube. YouTube, all right. Okay. Where are you from? I'm from Somalia. But Somalia? Yeah. But you live here? I don't live here. I just came for tourists. Ah, like me? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, have a good day. Have a good day. Somalian tourist. That's an unusual. I don't think I've ever met a Somalian tourist anywhere. But let's see what we can find. We went left, as he told me. But we've got the spices here and all that but not quite what I'm looking for. We also got clothes, Fenerbahce, Fenerbahce, uh, Galatasaray, Besiktas, the three big Istanbul teams. We've got Trabzonspor there as well. The fourth biggest team here in, in Turkey, up on the north coast, on the Black Sea. Now it seems like I'm coming out of the market. Not quite what I was planning. Okay, so I'm walking around here, realizing that it's not the biggest market that we've come to here. But there is everything we need, but it's literally just like a, a couple blocks. What I'm hunting for now is going to be dates. Hopefully we can find some really, I saw some good ones on the other side, some good looking ones anyways, they looked really <laughs> Like juicy and smooth, buttery. 
what else are they selling? They're selling clothes here, they're selling some kind of meat as well. Tupperware, plastic bags, or not plastic bags, plastic boxes. But yeah, let's go ahead and find some more stuff and then we also have to revisit that guy with the with the sandwich that looks really really good what he was selling over there so we're back on the other side on the main side this was where I saw another person selling dry fruits and so on that looked really really nice it was right here at the entrance over there at the entrance into the market not this one I think here on the corner there were some good ones Let's see, yeah, this one right here. Do you sell? This, um, Kurma, dates, Kurma. This one is this? Ein. The same? Ein, ein. The same? Okay. 79 for one? Let's see. Okay, yeah, the same one. Ein, ein. 79. Ein, yeah. This? 50 grams. 79. 50 grams. Okay. Okay. One. One. One, please. Just here. Just here. Too many plastic bags. One, two, three. Four. <laughs> 40. <Yeah>. Only. <laughs> Only 40. What is this? Fresh? Fresh? This fresh. Yeah. Ah, okay. So these are fresh things. Cool. I don't think I've ever taze. seen fresh dates. Taze, taze. Taze. So there's fresh dates here as well. These yellow ones that we have on the on the on the box here, or in the box there. Let's see. Hopefully it doesn't mind that I'm trying one. Ah. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. Fresh? Fresh. Taze. Taze. It's very bitter. The same. Fresh. Okay. This very bitter, sour. Fresh. This bitter. Okay. Let's try this one. Ah, much better. Okay. Okay. This is much better. Much better. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you. The other fresh one there was much better. The first one was very harsh, very dry, very, very bitter. Let's see this guy. What he's doing here. Hello. Where are you from? Denmark. Dinamark. 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 <laughs> How much one? Uh, one sandwich? Let's see here. Seyrek Yarim Tum. Which this is this? This is where are you? Kurem I am Kurem Jiza Haimana. Bah. Okay. One of this. Can I have? One with this? This one. Uh -huh. I want this. Uh, this tamam. Which Cherik. one? Is this? Huh? Ba. Okay. Bu uh bu. -huh. This is uh -huh. what? This one. Okay. This one. one. Okay. Tamam. One. Okay. <laughs> so we're getting the Yarim one here. Meat, Meat. is uh, cow, sheep, 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 sheep stomach, stomach or liver. Yes, exactly. I think it's sheep liver of some sort. Liver. Okay. This is gonna be exciting. And chili. Spicy. As you know, I love spicy. We want spicy. Okay. 
Like the drums. Uh -huh. Like the Metallica. Metallica. So yeah, this one is going to be mine. We've got, we've got chili spices. Chili. Oregano. Keki. Keki. Uh -huh. That one. I think this one is cumin here. Cumin or cumin? Cumin. 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 Okay, I guess right. It is cumin. So let's see. Man, the lights here on the camera are flashing like crazy. It's mine. Me. Ah. Ah, okay. Do you need this? Ah, no seats. <laughs> it's gonna hurt if you sit there. Hey, you don't want to be sitting on this one. That's gonna, that's gonna hurt your bum. Unless that's your thing, of course. Then you can go along. Okay. I think I need to pay somewhere else. Money will cost a bit. Come on, man. Over here. Okay. okay. I pay with this guy over here, it seems like. Let's go ahead. I guess I can take a seat here. I think we just sit and eat first. I was ready to pay, but. But yeah. It seems like they just eat and then pay. So let's put our money back in the pockets. Let's have a dive. If I understood him right, this is supposed to be sheep liver. Let's put you guys down over here and try this. Turkish food. Hopefully it's gonna be good. Okay. Very spicy. Obviously. It was pretty good. Let's just try the meat here. <laughs> On its own. Mm. You can't taste that it's liver in any way, shape or form. Like I've tried liver a couple of times, but like a whole piece, not like chopped up like this. I'm basically just tasting spicy. But it is my mouth is on fire here. Woo! My love is spicy. Check it out. Mm. It's quite good. I'll tell you what. Very very good. All right, I'll finish my extremely spicy sandwich here, and then we'll keep exploring. Okay, so we're out of the main part of the market here, back around the corner towards the main street. And if my memory serves me correct, which I can see it does, there are the last thing that I said we needed, baklavas. These pastries, we've got a few of them here. Let's just take a walk along along the road here along the shop fronts here to see what they all offer and then we take the one that looks the best and we buy a little little box of that turkish desserts turkish pastries um to, to entertain ourselves with on the on the train ride tomorrow hmm. do you know this good which one? Best, better, better. This one, uh, this one, uh. Okay, go, go. I think he said this one is good. I'm gonna ask the man behind the till here which one is his best one. We have something here, fistiliki, and then we have baklava. These little creamy pastries, that's what we want. I'm gonna give it a go. Let's see what he has. Mix? Mix, yes. Mix, yes. mix. Which one is best? Best. <laughs> All of that, 100. So we're getting a box here. <laughs> Your name? This one? Okay, that looks good. That looks good. Check it out. Huh? Uh, Pink Garden Explorers. How are you? 
I'm good. I'm good. Are you? You. Are you good? Okay. You're good. Turkey. Turkey. Let's go Turkey. <laughs> All right. I love you. Uh huh. Turkish, I love you. Turkish, I love you. Uh, in Turkish, I don't know how. How I say? <laughs> how I say in Turkish? Let's see. It's friend here. It's a kind of like sounds like German in that sense. A friendship country with Turkey. Like, a lot of the time when they're just talking, it sounds like they're really arguing with each other. It's hard to, hard to figure out whether someone is angry or not, or whether they're just simply saying, Where did you leave the cream? Where's the cream? Come on, lads. Hey, sadly. <laughs> you're, uh, you're like, oh, uh, when you talk. <laughs> he thinks it's funny. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we get a whole box like this. Oh, no, no, no. Yes. This, no? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay. There you go. Hundred. Oh, goodbye. Okay. Thank goodbye. you. Have thank a good you. day. <laughs> what a couple of nice lads. <laughs> he thinks it's funny. I was making, making fun of how agitated they talk. <laughs> what I was saying is, in that sense. Of course, German is not very agitated with the arms and like this and all that. That's more, that's more something I'm used to from Latin America, of course. <coughs> but the way it sounds when they're talking to each other, it really does sound sometimes, even though they are just saying like, where did you leave the boxes or something? It's like really agitated, really like in there. Which makes for good fun as you're observing the culture here and yes I was saying earlier people are really really nice Turkey is I don't really it's hard to communicate with many people here but but they are really really nice they're interested in you interested in where you're from interested in trying to talk even though they don't speak much English and of course my Turkish is at least for now terrible but give me a month and a half of traveling around here in Turkey and Maybe I'll be able to say at least a few words other than just Salam. Salam Alaikum. Which you also say here where, when you greet someone coming into a shop or so on or a restaurant, even though it's an Arabic word, because Turkey is a Muslim country. Speaking of that, right behind me here we have a little tiny mosque with the tower there that we heard in the intro <laughs> in the intro of the video today. But yeah. Really, really good first impressions of Turkey throughout my first week. Istanbul, I was in Istanbul as well. I did not make any video in Istanbul because I was like, Istanbul just is a really nice city, but it's, it's your typical metropolitan city. It doesn't, it feels a lot more Turkish here in, in, in Ankara. More of these little markets that are much less touristy as well, like into more of these little markets, the, the little shops like this one, the little restaurants like these ones here, just like the culture of people, feels, feels different, feels more Turkish if you know what I mean. We've got more of the old buildings, historical citadels like um, that we've got on top of the hill behind me here. I'm just gonna go back to the hotel, drop off this, and then as I said, we'll head up to that citadel and finish the video up there with a beautiful view over the city of Ankara at sunset. So let's go. Cut to after hotel room. Okay, so we've dropped off the, the bags of my shopping at the hotel and I'm just about to embark, or I have just embarked on the hike up the hill up here behind the trees. As you can see here are the front walls of the old citadel or castle here on the hill overlooking Ankara. Check it out, already a wonderful view. But as we get to the top, we're gonna have more or less a 360 view of the whole city. I went up here the first afternoon as I arrived with the train from Istanbul to Ankara and I really, really enjoyed it. Again, as I said earlier, and as we will see once we come up there, I guess, 
there really are many tourists here in, in Ankara compared to Istanbul considering the fact that it's the second biggest city and the capital of the country there's very very few uh, tourists here in the city it mainly seems to be local Turkish tourism um, here in Ankara and as we saw earlier a couple of Somalians as well that probably are on a journey immigrating further up north I would guess because back where I'm from in Denmark there is quite a lot of there are quite a lot of Somalian uh, immigrants or refugees living there so I guess the ones that have better means than to be a, re a refugee they probably seek their way up from Somalia into Egypt across the Middle East and arrive here in Turkey and here we go the entrance in towards the I think second to last of the inside walls into the castle itself or citadel as they're called in this part of the world this particular citadel is the Ankara Kalesi or the Ankara citadel dates back to 800 years 8th century before Christ that gives you an idea of how old this region of the world is as you should know this is basically where we all come from the Middle East more so the Iraq Syria Jordan area here in Turkey as well there was a lot of the early civilizations around uh, the world as well as Syria and Iraq and that's where we're gonna go and and try and find later on on the trip when I get to the near the Iraqi border I want to see what the situation is and try and try and get into the Iraqi Kurdistan as well because there I've researched my way to that we have the oldest citadel in the world in a town called Erbil as you can see all the houses inside are all white some of them still being restored like this one here they're all beautiful old white houses these little cute alleyways reminds me of some Mediterranean little village it's beautiful can you imagine a much how to imagine a much cooler place to live eh and there are people living in here as you can see I've got a couple of guys over here there's a little shop <laughs> there's a little shop selling fruit and veg like down in the market to the local residents here in in this area inside the that are living here inside the citadel <sighs> all right let's get up to the very top before the sun goes down as you can see behind the house there it is just about to happen but it's not far yet so let's get our skates on and race to the top before the sun goes down now it's a lot of you and a half a what we've come to the top check it out we've got the whole citadel around us here we've got the the courtyard down there in the middle and the, the walls going out leading out to the city of Ankara itself we've got a little viewpoint over there and we've got the main viewpoint over here on this side and again as I was saying earlier literally all we seem to see here are local Turkish tourists I'm not seeing any I've seen a few Asian Chinese or Korean or something tourists around here but in general you really don't see any so check it out we've got the other part of the tower over there where the flag is flying high catching the last rays of the Sun 
and all the people enjoying the view here. So there we go. The center of the city of Ankara. Over here we've got the main mosque. The new center, this is the old center in front of us here. The tower from which they are crying their prayers. That's been a beautiful first video. Right, so the camera died on me there before when I was sitting up top. But as I was saying, I was just about to do the outro. So before the camera dies again, I want to say thanks for watching the video. I think that was a beautiful first, a beautiful start to our trip around Turkey. A good first introduction to what is Turkey, a good introduction to what is Ankara. And with that said, thanks for watching. And I will see you on tomorrow's video, heading on the train out to the Kurdistan area of Turkey, out to Tatvan. So before the camera dies, I'm out. Thanks for watching.